Another popular one with the little guys is a dinosaur. We went with a green dinosaur because green seems to be pretty popular in the dinosaur community. We're going to start out with his head. Now, we're going to make a bubble that's about two, three inches long, and we're going to duplicate the same bubble. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to use our nozzle like we did on our part line, and we're going to join the two bubbles together at the bottom, take that nozzle, and squeeze it through between the two bubbles so they can't come apart. And we're going to make one more bubble, a round bubble this time, and make an ear twist like this is on our teddy bear. And this is going to be the head of our dinosaur. And we're going to make the bubble that will be his neck. Another bubble is about two to three inches long. And we're going to make two little legs and lock twist them together. We see that our dinosaur is starting to show up. Now we want our dinosaur to stand up a little bit more erect, so we're going to put an ear twist on the back. We'll make an ear twist right there. And he starts to stand up right there. Now, two more little bubbles. Two round ones and then two more. Now, third Two will go up and two will come down and we'll lock twist them right there at the base. And we're going to make one more bubble. Now this is a tricky little thing called a roll through. We're going to make a bubble that's basically the length of the two bubbles together. And we're going to push it through, rolling the bubbles to the outside. Come through like that. And what we made is some Spikes on the back of our dinosaur. Now we'll end with two legs, just like a dog's leg. Not twist them in. And here we have Balloonosaurus Rex. Roar! Hope he's a herbivore. <laughs>